you remember the trick which goes one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. You can transfer that across the strings by going one, two, three, four, five, six. So you can work out your scales that way without having to memorize and play patterns and get it into muscle memory. You know, if you do this enough, it'll come to muscle memory. But we're all beginners here, so we'll save the muscle memory for later. But the, the interesting thing is once you know the one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight pattern, you can then number the notes. And if you start here with G, for example, we can go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And then if we do one, three, five, six, and what we're doing is we're playing an arpeggio in the root that we started with. If I start in a G and I go one, three, five, six, one, three, five, six. And then if I came down a string, which would be if I go G, E, F. And then I go playing a bass line in the in the key that I started in, just by knowing that I'm playing every other note in the scales. 